What is the worst tax experience you have ever had? Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> it had to be me. <laughs> This is something I'm not ashamed to share with you <laughs> because it could happen to you, so be prepared. I actually received a congressional audit. I thought, this is not possible. <laughs> Called my congressman and said, you mean they can, this is not a joke, they can actually come in and go through your underwear drawer at piggy banks and see if you have money stashed. Congress voted this in, so I was one of those lucky participants that won that right that year. It went on for three years. Fortunately for me, my creative solution to anything is interpretive dance and smiling and waving. <laughs> <laughs> so with that, I tortured this poor IRS man. He came to the house several times. I discovered this is illegal and considered sexual harassment. So I milked that one too. <laughs> <laughs> Keeping a record of everything you've ever done is really hard. Therefore, what you do is you keep a calendar of whatever year tucked in your tax stuff. So the taxman actually told me if there's something that needs to be done that you forgot about, you can stick it on that calendar that you had from five years ago, six years ago, seven years ago, later. So, so that you have the record. Because as long as it's written on a calendar from the appropriate date, you are safe and good to go. So I think that would be the most terrifying thing because I should have paid the $20,000 they asked for and ended up they owed me $2,509. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>